look, we understand, <laughs> same thing goes for Anton Daniels too, and Coach Greg Adams. Coach Greg Adams, uh, he himself, uh, his marriage failed, right, by his own admission. Got a divorce, and he's now advocating for the free agent lifestyle, which is like the male version of feminism, right? Just I'm, I'm just going off of the concept. In the sense that, screw marriage and just have fun, just live your best life by just sleeping with a bunch of women and look, any person that advocates for that lifestyle is just sad and miserable. Ergo, you know, misery loves company. And, you know, he, Coach Greg Adams claims that, oh, his wife did him a favor when, he, when she divorced him. Because now she can go, because now he can go to the JUCO, i.e. junior college, and sleep with as, as many flatbacks, uh, supreme flatbacks, young 20-year-olds, like, <laughs> you know when he hits uh, the 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 sound the soundtrack the sound bites the buzzer sound bites, <laughs> right? Look, people who pe people who you know think uh, think like that they're just miserable. Because coach coach Greg Adams, tell me, uh, then why why did you get married in the first place? If your wife did you a favor by leaving you, by divorcing you, then why did you even bother getting married in the first place? You didn't think, I mean, you didn't view marriage the same way now, did you back then? You saw it necessary to be happy, raising kids, you know, in, in, in a stable household, in a, in a marriage, right? You saw it necessary to get, to get married and have kids, right? And now you're saying... Your wife divorcing you was the best thing ever. He she did you a favor. Then why be getting bothered getting married in the first place? Why? And don't try to uh, try to escape by saying, "Well, I didn't know back then." No, 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 no. I'm plugging that hole. You're not gonna escape that hole. I understand something. That's a very selfish, self uh, self fulfilling prophecy in the first place, because marriage is not about you as an individual. Marriage is a, 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 an institution to raise kids. You have kids, right, Coach Greg Adams, right? You have a son and a daughter. Understand, some, understand something. When you say your wife divorcing you is the best thing ever, she, she, she was the best thing ever for who? For you or, or, or for your kids? Because now your kids are low-key traumatized because now mommy and daddy no longer live in the same house. Mommy and daddy are now constantly taking back and uh, take each other taking each other back uh, back and forth to court in and out of in and out of court battling for child custody such traumatizes kids FYI Mr. Adams such trauma tra traumatizes kids you might you know might finally be you know somewhat be happy Oh, I can sleep with, you know, the, 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 the supreme flatbacks. But your son and your daughter, they're traumatized. They're sad. They're upset. Because this is not ideal. This is not an ideal uh, lifestyle for, you know, for, for a family. Your kids are now in a broken family. Mommy and dad are now fighting. They're divorced. Because trust and believe, your son prefers... You and your wife being together. They prefer mommy and daddy being together. Because that's a, sta sta a stable family union. 